just continuing looking at converting to base units some measurements we've got 0 0.5 megameters is 5 times 10 to the 5 meters 765 milliseconds 0 0.765 seconds 10 mega amps or mega amperes amps being short for amperes 1 times 10 to the 7 amps 32 micro amps is 3.2 times 10 to the minus 5 amps 56 gigaseconds, 5.6 times 10 to the 10 seconds, and 0 0.625 milliamps is 6.25 times 10 to the minus 4 amps. So make sure that you can do those conversions and you understand how they are derived. If we have a look at the measurements now, so converting the following metric measurements. To, from not necessarily two SI units, just to other derived units. So 1,000 milligrams is one gram, 160 centimeters, 1,600 millimeters, 109 grams, 0 0.109 kilograms, and so on, so forth. So just a few there for you to pause the video and make sure that you can complete. Sometimes you are asked to estimate certain things. So you can give a range of something. So for example, the mass of an apple, as long as you're not writing, as long as you're writing in the, in the on the same order of magnitude, which means that, for example, you're not writing one kilogram or you're not writing 10 grams, you're not writing one gram then you're going to be okay and that goes for all of it as long as you're in the correct order of magnitude GCSE for an estimate question you should be okay so we'll move on to accuracy and precision in our next video